Hey guys, Henry here again, back at you with another reaction video today. We're taking a look at the Feng Wei trailer for Tekken. Uh, this came out a few days ago, but I haven't had a chance to take a look at it yet, so I'm, I'm kind of excited to see this one. I'm not a huge uh, Feng player myself, but I do appreciate having a character like that in the game. I, I know he's really popular amongst a lot of people, so I am uh, interested, interested to see uh, you know what they've changed about him. So uh, let's take a look. Alright, here we go guys. Here we go. I'm ready. Unreal, unreal. Get ready, for the next Get ready for the next battle, baby. Here we go. The God Fist? Whoa. Whoa! His face looks weird. Okay. Ooh, back turn. Okay. Back. Yeah. Back turn. Bump. Is it wall standing too? Oh, there you go. Parry stance. Uh, 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 Iron Mountain. There you go. Oh, he has a rivalry with Leroy. Oh, he actually has dialogue? He actually talks. The elbows. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's like a season three, or season two uh, wall carry. Okay. Yeah, plus unblock into a, some type of wall unblockable. Wow. That was his crouch dash into two, I think. Oh, damn, that's so sick. I like that one. That's a sick super. Okay. Huh. It's, it's, it's so good to see that release date in the middle of the screen now instead of that fist meets fate bullshit. Oh, yeah, here's the close beta. Yeah, I'm guaranteed to get in because I got in the first one. So the second one, no problem. Okay, okay, let's take a look at that. He looks, he looks good here, but I think in practice, like in the actual gameplay footage, how do I explain it? It has something to do with, I don't know if it's like the cheeks or the lips or something. It, his face just looks really weird. I don't know. I can't put my finger on it. This looks cool. I like this pose of him. This angle. I think it's because his mouth is not open like it was before, so it looks a bit better. He has a, it has a stance where he steps backward. That's back turned one plus two, I think. Yeah, well, yeah, back turn 1 plus 2, which gives him a guaranteed overhead heel kick. And that was a Kenpo stance again. I think that's down... I think it might be, like, down 3 plus 4, and it only works when the character is lying on the ground. Oh, he blocked that. So he gets a guaranteed uh, launcher right here. I don't remember if that split kick, that split thing that he just did right there, I don't know if that's in Tekken 7. That might be new-ish. That's like a new animation they gave him, but it looks like to be some sort of wall standing two or something like that. Yeah, that's a parry. So that's a parry stance I think he's doing. Like he blocks the moves and also can attack immediately after. Yeah, that's a parry stance. Boom, stunned. And that is forward. I think it's forward three, four. Forward three and then four gives you like this. St that's a very, that's a, that's his most famous launcher, I believe. Everyone knows this launcher. Every Fang player uses this launcher to get a combo going so now it's a screw attack yeah and then it gives you the the guaranteed iron mountain so iron mountain i think it's forward one plus two while you're uh standing up gives you an iron mountain it's like a 12 or a 13 frame uh shoulder that gives you like a wall splat wall ender like it's just a really good move it does crazy damage too, like 30 something damage i think this is kind of cool. He has a weird, uh, he has some sort of rivalry with Leroy. I don't know how that's going to play out, but it's nice to see Leroy having some sort of, some sort of lore to heat mode. Yeah, that's his, um, that, that string that he just did. I think that's like a season two uh, string that he had from Tekken 7. Yeah, we're, yeah, yeah, exactly. He turns around with his shoulder. It's like a wall carry. Okay, so that gave him some sort of... Yeah, so parry stance gave him a stun, which gives you a guaranteed Iron Mountain. 
And it looks like Iron Mountain is now a heat engager, which is kind of crazy. Yeah, that's a heat move for that's a heat move for sure. Yeah, back, okay, back step two, I think. So I don't. That's his uh, in Tekken Seven, I believe that's his power crush. I don't know if it's a power crush in this game, but when you fully charge it, it's really plus. And in here, that's like the symbol or like the the effect for something that's unblockable, I believe. And because he's his guard is open, it gave him a guaranteed back one, and back one at the wall gives you a wall splat. Yes, which gave him that guaranteed screw, wall ender. That's a new move. So his he has an overhead heel kick, is just like in T7. But in this game, it seems to stomp the ground, which I think is some sort of low that forces crouch. And from there, he was able to get a launcher into a heat cancel. There you go. I believe that's his. He has a, a stance where he crouches forward, kind of like what Yoshimitsu does, kind of thing. It's like a roll dash. And he gets a, a launcher from, if you press 2, I believe that's what that was. It's a roll dash into 2. Yeah, and it's like a big, juicy launcher, big uppercut. And he goes, he gets lazy right into the super. This is sick super, though. It's way, this is by far way better than his rage art in T7. Way more interesting. Like this, this yellow dragon thing, this is kind of cool. Yeah, and he actually has dialogue, which is cool. He doesn't just say, Laiba! He doesn't just say that anymore. He actually speaks. That was a much yeah. I was I like that trailer. It was a good trailer. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, Feng Wei more in the game. He was always a character that you see uh, very successful in tournaments. And of course, we have the closed beta test announcement that's going to happen in October. I am for sure getting in because I got the first one, and they specifically say on the website that if you played in the first game, or sorry, if you participated in the first beta that you got into the second every subsequent beta after that you get into guaranteed so that's uh definitely making me hype and uh apparently you get to play as raven and azucena in this new uh second beta so i'm excited to try out uh, i'm actually excited to try out both characters i really want to play azucena i want to i want to try that that dancing stuff that she does well guys uh looks like we got ourselves a nice new trailer nice to see that feng wei's come back i'm looking forward to playing the beta let me know if you guys are excited for feng wei you guys feng wei players feng wei mains out there let me know in the comments below feel free to like and subscribe join the discord twitter all that good stuff i'll see you guys on twitch as usual and until then i'll see you guys later